Hi everybody, I'm the Reluctant Reviewer. And I'm QP83. And on this rainy, rainy, rainy day, I figured I would show you something that I don't think I ever really showed you or I might just put some pictures together a long time ago. Um, this is a Barbie dream house. It, yeah. Circa. Uh, 1961. It's the first Barbie dream house. Like literally the first one The ever. first dream house. And I picked this up at a flea market in Wisconsin a long time ago, and it was a husband selling it for his wife. It was hers when she was little. Yes. So it's a one, it was a one owner dollhouse. This is really the nicest I've seen of the outside box. Um, you know, it has a few little, little tear kind of parts that are starting, but not much. It, it is not signed by the little owner, mm -mm. just to make sure nobody else steals it. <laughs> um, so there's, let me put this, turn this baby around. It's really in nice shape. Especially considering it's made out of a thick cardboard. cardboard. Called chipboard, but essentially it's a thick cardboard. <laughs> right, and like you've got a little tear up here, but it hasn't gone to the other side because mm -mm. it's thick enough. And its little fasteners are still in good shape too. This is Barbie Dreamhouse Barbie fashion model. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Alright, so we're going to open this up and we're going to show you what it looks like. Alright, so we've opened the, the fastener. That wall goes down. Then we have a wall here. This is like my holy grail item. Mm -hmm. I mean, you don't take it out in the rain. You don't have dirty hands when you touch it. <laughs> because I would never, <laughs> ever have gotten one of these before. Wait, wait, wait. What? Put that down. Okay. Oh, it goes down like that. Okay. Well, yeah, you want the floor. There. I, I love that it has little um, squares so you could actually align your stuff up. So I have to remember how everything is put in here so that I can put it back again. Um, we have a bed. And um, if you look in, uh, what, the, what is the name of that book that we have? The Encyclopedia of Barbie Doll, Friends and Family Licensed Products. Which is a really good book. Um, it tells you all the things that should be included in each playset. Yes. So I don't recall what's missing. I think I have a pillow missing and maybe a pendant missing, but I'm not quite sure. Maybe we'll a couple records. So, so we, fun fact though, this was this cost originally between four forty four and eight dollars, which was a lot of money. And now it can retail in like triple digits. But <laughs> that was a lot of money then. You have to understand that was ex an expensive product. It's a cardboard for sure, <laughs> but, but it lasted. <laughs> this one is is in beautiful shape. I love it. So we have a bed. Which you can see, it's cardboard too. It has a little crease there, but I don't care. And it has legs. Then we have a couch, which this one's coming out of, its peg is coming out. But I'm going to leave it that way. So it's a really nice couch. Can it is see? a really nice couch. It's a very pretty print. And then we have our coffee table and our hi-fi. We've got the our stereo and our television all mm -hmm. in one. As this part opens that up, up, there's your record player. Do, 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 do. And of course, Barbie's on TV. Because she's a teen supermodel. So we can put it there. We have a picture of Aww. Ken, our beloved. We'll put the hi-fi up. Leave that on. If it doesn't want to go, we're not staying there. Stand. Okay, what else do I have over here? Do, 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 do. On this side, oh, we, you get to go on this side okay. because I can't see the side. I actually have two pictures of Ken because somehow they had two pictures. So we get, we really love our Ken. All right, so what are we? You do this side. So we have an, uh, a chair ottoman, okay. which we don't have the chair out yet, but I guess we can put it here. Uh, this would be the chair. Pretty blue, nice. I like she has nice bright yellow walls. There's frames, you've got windows shown, you've got pendants that say state on them. A lamp? Mm-hmm. A lamp for... We could probably put it over here on the hi-fi. We'll 
Oh, this is another chair. That's a chair. That's right here. Oh, that goes right there. Oh, for the vanity. The vanity, oh, yeah. I'll put it on there. And then let me move Ken's, Ken's picture. picture. Um, we have... Looks like the encyclopedia, maybe the great uh, classics to put on the table there. And then another set of books, maybe college books. So I am missing things like the pillows. I'm missing, that's what I'm missing. The pillows and the hangers. Well, you can tell me what I'm missing. Yeah, I'm sure so it doesn't say three pictures missing. of Ken. We're gonna say, oh Ken, I want, I want you to be here. There you go. Essentially, mm -hmm. we're missing the records for the record player, of which there are six. Sinatra, uh, Vic Fontaine, the Kingston Trio, the Letterman, the four preps on campus, and Nat King Cole. And Whoa. then we're missing two pennants, which are also not here. Just ones. These are already printed on yeah, here. Yeah, just separate pennants. And then there should be five different cushions for the sofas and things. So I'm missing all the cushions, which it's understandable. Those would be the things that you were missing. And we have two sets of books. And now I can't open my record player. Let me see. Here we go. I can't tell what that is. Hangers, I'm missing. That's, wait a minute, that's the, maybe the directions were in there? So I'm missing the little things, it looks like. We're missing the hangers, because this is your closet here. The records, records. And the pillows and two pendants, mm -hmm. which isn't bad. I have the big stuff. No. It's pretty good. It's near complete. And it's a nice condition. It's it's lovely. And of course, Barbie wants to come and, and, and look. Um, did it come with a sham for the uh, the bed? It doesn't say it came with a sham. Just a uh, cardboard pillow that she's supposed to have yes. there. But it doesn't say it came with a blanket or anything. So apparently Barbie could only afford a studio because mm -hmm. it's only one big giant room. So what do you think of it? I think it's pretty cool. I like that it is really big even though it's just one room and set up when compared to current dream houses for this is a breeze. You don't have to deal with an elevator, putting plastic pieces into other plastic pieces and having it be complicated and hard. Having so them I break. think it's pretty cool. <laughs> Yeah, having the break, and having the elevator not it's work. It's pretty good, like thick cardboard. So, and it's all very bright and not pink at all. Like I know, the, literally I, not pink. <laughs> I don't think there was a pink at that time. I don't think it, anything was pink. It's like nice bright yellow. I like it. I like the color scheme. Um, that's a new dog <laughs> barking. Apparently, other dogs aren't supposed to be walking around the block, or people, or squirrels or morning doves. And uh, I know I can find other stuff to go on there, so maybe I can find some of the pendants or the pillows, and now I will be motivated. Because right mm -hmm. now, since it's a holy grail item, I keep it up really, really high, and then I could tell how much dust mm -hmm. gets on my stuff when I took it down, so now I'll be able to clean its area again. But to have this out, you re need a nice big size table yeah. that you could leave it out. Because I wanted to do that and I don't have a corner of my house that I could just do that and leave it. You really need like the doll room, like just the doll room. The collection room. Or the you know? garage that you turned into the doll room. Yeah. With heat. Something. But um, it, I was just happened to be lucky on that one day that I went to a flea market and they had something really, really, really cool. And I liked that it was only one owner and it's, it's in great condition. And now if I could find the dress, um, the, the store. The dress store, the yeah. The dress store, and um, you saw one that you would like to get. Um, so the fashion shop is what you were talking about. Yes, I would like that. I've seen it once, but I didn't have money for it. And I quite like the Barbie Goes to College, which is a campus. And I've never seen that at a show it's anywhere. Sears exclusive. And then oh, there's the uh, Skipper classroom. The Skipper school room that I personally would like in my collection. Of course you would. 
You'd like it to be four dollars too, right? Yes, exactly. <laughs> so they price match against this book. So if anybody has one, she would not mind one. So. <laughs> She'll or take it off I might go hands. up to ten dollars for you, maybe. <laughs> And a lot of times when you're looking at them on eBay, um, they've had water damage, they have a smell because they've been in storage. Um, this one, it was just so wonderful. Yes. So I thought you'd like to have a look and we'll just take some pictures and put little dolls in them and then maybe it's something that next time you go to a show, maybe you'll look for, ask somebody who handles only Barbie merchandise and they can probably hunt for one for you. Yeah. So, pretty cool. Have a lovely day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye.